High end radio, nigga. On the sickness network. You feel me? The niggas that really make it, you know, they ain't got their ass whooped a couple times not coming in the house when they're supposed to because they still out there shooting. That's right. You feel me? <laughs> you gotta pull them niggas off the field and off the court and off all. Them little motherfuckers that make it. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker just sit up here and write a rhyme every now and then. Nigga, you think you're gonna be hella successful? Shit, no. Yeah, it don't happen and like that. And it's the work that you putting in when don't nobody know you putting it in. It's what counts. Right. You feel me? Because I don't give a fuck what you do. They ask me for the new shit, man. Put an album out right now, today. By the end of next month, two months, I want a new one coming out. My nigga enjoy this one all the way. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You build a, you, you, you know, you, you, so you a boxer, my nigga. You come out with a nigga ass. You been training all year. I'm like, well, who you fighting next? Hold on, my nigga. I just whoop this nigga ass. Let me, let me set it up. Let me see who next. Yeah. Yeah. Let me regroup. Exactly. Yeah. You're right. You're right. It's funny you say that because, uh, back to the thing about niggas dropping an album and three months later, they write back with another one. We in a, we're in that age where, you can post your album on Facebook or Dat Piff and you think you done did it. Yeah, yeah, but that's what got a lot of niggas thinking they famous when they not. You know, and you don't determine your fame. It's the people that support you that determine how successful you are. You know, anybody can walk around, yeah, I'm that nigga, I'm the hardest artist. You can actually be the tightest motherfucking artist in the world, but if don't nobody know about your record, you ain't gonna sell nothing. It's that simple. You know what I'm saying? You can have all this shit on beats, rhymes, all that. But if don't nobody know about it, it's going to sit right there on the computer. Feel me? So I ain't mad that if somebody just know me for, you know, rapping with Dub C or being on Crazy Tones mixtape or, you know, my own mixtapes or me being on that video game. It don't matter how you know about me, just know what you know about. You feel me? And you might not even know that you know the voice. You feel, I mean, you might not know the name, but you know the voice and just don't know it. Right. Because they sell more video games than I'll probably ever sell records. You feel me? Yeah. 20 million video games at $50 a piece to a billion dollars. Damn. You feel me? <laughs> so you might not like rap. You might not like black people. You might not like melee, but you know the voice. Huh? <laughs> yeah, if you never let a black person into your home and you bought your child GTA, you have let melee. <laughs> High end radio, nigga. On the sickness network. I think it's just gang banging. You know what I mean? Period, point blank. So it's like if you're not doing that, then stay your ass out the way because it's going down right now. You know, that was good that they were shooting a movie and getting everybody chances to come out and do different things and shit like that. But at the same time, you know, it, it's a whole lot of ignorance out there. And that's, that's everywhere in America. They ain't just in L.A. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's just more or less, I, I think it depends on, on people's situations. You know what I'm saying? Because if you look at it, you don't see nowhere with you know, where they're making a lot of money at a high crime area. It's always somewhere where, you know, money ain't plentiful and there's fucked up shit going on. Yeah. I, if, if, you know, shit, if motherfuckers had shit to lose, they wouldn't put their freedom on the line so fast. They wouldn't be willing to risk everything they got over maybe an altercation or a situation. When you got motherfuckers that's on their last leg and trying to figure shit out, the smallest thing is to look for the wrong comment or anything. You can start some shit that'll change your life, my nigga. Yeah, you right. You right, homie. Yeah, that's why I stay on my square, man, and around niggas that, you know, that, that I can learn from. You feel me? <laughs> like, fans, dub seat. You feel me? Doug don't get a lot of credit for a lot of shit that he do because he don't walk around bragging on that shit. And he ain't sold out to no corporate shit either. Nah, nah. And, you know, always, like, keep it simple. Motherfuckers don't know, man. Doug's a good nigga. And you might listen to that nigga's lyrics and, you know, look at the nigga facials and you're like, yeah, that nigga like, asshole. Whoop, whoop, this, that, this, that. That nigga Doug, she look crazy. I heard it all. Doug was intelligent. Doug was a smart 
up, nigga. That was a good nigga. You feel me? And by me rocking with him, I didn't learn, like, so much shit. Like, you know, you could be a good rapper in the studio. What's your show performance like, huh? Yeah. How can you how can you take over a crowd? Yeah. This is a high-end radio exclusive. The first motherfuckers I heard of was Outkast, though. Yep, me too. Yep. Like big boy here at the pit bulls, was doing this shit. Smart though, because there's money outside of rap. You meet other different people, you learn more shit in life. Right. Rapping, you ain't learning but the business. You know what I mean? You're meeting different artists, this, 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 and that. Okay, when you start venturing off with different things, acquiring that knowledge, sometimes it takes a little bit of time. Right. You feel me? That's just like when you, you know, like I'm fucking with these dogs. You can't just go buy some dogs and breed them and then think you a goddamn dog breeder. <laughs> yeah. that you just gonna sell them. Yeah, yeah. It don't work like that. It's politics with that shit, how it is with anything. Right. Right. You know, but a nigga, nigga all over the place right now, man, trying to just build a, a, a whole different program other than just rap. You feel me? Yes, rap would be, rap is more or less like, you know, shit, it's, it's what a nigga do, it's fun, but it ain't to the point to where it's gonna be, oh, that's the only thing I'm doing, hell no. You know what I'm saying? And, and our people in general, meaning, you know, motherfuckers from the street, I don't care if you Crip Blood, uh, uh, Serenio, whatever yeah. the case, yeah. motherfuckers from the streets all fuck with the same shit. Low, Cars, ride, low riders, pit bulls, and motorcycles. No. <laughs> You feel me? Yeah. Cars, motorcycles, dogs, the bitches and weed. Yeah. And everybody trying to get money. So, you know what I'm saying? Everybody on the same type of situation that's from the streets. So, why not incorporate everything into the same shit? This is a high end radio exclusive. DJ Nightfall. It's melee for melee, produced by Chibu. Real street dude, known for sticking to the Chibu. Can't get with the program, then Please move. My nigga get pop locked up, then Me too. I'm working like a slave, like they did the Chibu. Melee, trying to stay paid like these Jews. In the shark tank, heartbreak can't keep cool. Jacking all cars, hitting banks with these two. Stomping my feet to the beat like, like a beast too. Snitch to the pigs, they can get the beast too. About to sip soup through a straw between. Cooling off the broth as I'm flossing her. Mean cool. Fitted hat flip, fresh tees and clean shoes. Button up 501 leaves and crease smooth. Color coordinated, segregated and each group. Enemies recognize me, then we shoot. I'm from LA, LA, la la land. Where they cock back and pop like la, la. man. I'm from LA, LA, la la land. Where they cock back and pop like la, la. man. I'm from LA, 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 LA. What you mad for? Cause I'm an asshole Attitude be fucked up with my cash low I'm from East La, no grass grow Gang unit come through the front and I'm out the back door They can beat on the window until the glass broke All they see is paraphernalia symbols of sack smoke Leave our sack so the flag half show Smash in the seven dudes glass Black spokes, some people clown and they laugh But I don't crack jokes It's how you get down on your ass just like the last folks Type of women we have in traveling with passports Sassy but nasty and to the last stroke huh. They so beautiful Their usuals The stash dope For their OG uncles That drug smuggle On flat boats Cartels Them hard fellas Is that so? Get you anything You ask for huh. I'm from LA 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 Land Where they cock back And pop like la, la. Man I'm from LA 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 Land Where they cock back And pop like la, la. Man I'm from LA Hey 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 I'm from LA DJ Nightfall.